I'm really proud to be the UK's first divorce PA. I don't know, I might be the world's first divorce PA, but anyway, there we go. Um, it's a great thing, and I'm so pleased that I've chanced upon this opportunity. Um, it's fantastic for me to know that I'm making a difference to people's lives. And not only that, all of the professionals that are related to the divorce process that I've met, and it's been quite a number through the networking events that I've been to, have been universally, absolutely wholehearted in their support of what I'm doing. They've all expressed that it's an absolutely needed thing that will really, really help their clients and make a difference for people. So that has given me a tremendous amount of confidence. And I would absolutely urge anyone who has really quite good PA skills, but also that compassionate nature and a real experience of life and wants to make a difference to people, that it's a fantastic idea to do it and to complement maybe an existing business that you have because this is a real niche. It's, it's very special, it's very unique, it's absolutely rewarding and I think you will find, if you're interested in doing this, that it would be very rewarding for you. And I work really hard. I've got a little network of people that I'm building around me, but I can't reach the whole of the country. I'm gonna have my work cut out just dealing with my area. There is fantastic opportunity to support people going through very similar situations all over this country. And I really envisage that within a few years, being a divorce PA will be something that you can A, be really proud of, and people will actually know what it is. So why not get in there and be there at the beginning? So these days, as we all know, there are a plethora of opportunities for promoting your business, and online is a massive part of that. I don't know about you, but I'm not really an expert on all this social media stuff. So, as part of what I pay for by being part of the Alternative Divorce Directory, Susie supports me by, she will write articles for me, she will feature things that I've maybe put together and sent to her, she will distribute that amongst her enormous social media network, and there's all these opportunities for promotion of your business through the whole network of people that are featured on there. But also Susie has some fantastic contacts in the media, national media. She's been featured on many mainstream radio and TV programmes and she's an absolute trusted authority in this area. And so it is not unusual to get a little bit of media interest from, for example, somebody from a national newspaper who picks up on what you do. So the delivery of the divorce PA training itself is a very comprehensive affair. Firstly, there's a hands-on face-to-face session through which you explore and learn about all the critical features of the process. And then there's a manual, which obviously has gone through at the time, but is then accessible to you online, so you have permanent reference. And in addition to that, there's an online training portal, as it were, through which you can access training videos to revisit the information that you've been through on the course and also to enhance and improve that understanding that you've gained. And as part of what you're paying for in this training, you then get a very special rate for the first year on the Alternative Divorce Directory. And this means, well, it means lots of fantastic things. Firstly, you've got exposure to a whole network of people who might be interested in your services that you would otherwise probably struggle to contact. Secondly, you've, as we've already discussed, have this confidence element that people know you wouldn't be on there unless you actually had the right accreditation. So that's really good. You immediately have access to the other professionals who are on the directory who are all experts in their fields. And there's a massive opportunity for cross-referral work. So just as I'm referring to the financial planner or potentially a divorce lawyer, equally, those people refer back to you. So it's very important. People trust people that they know. And so if you build a network of people that you have interacted with who are in your local area, who know who you are, they know why you're doing it, they understand and they get what you're trying to achieve, this is a really powerful tool for marketing and growing your own business. Can anybody be a divorce PA? Well, potentially, if you have the training, it's pretty much like most things in life. What's for sure is, as with most things that are worthwhile, if you've got some form of accreditation, something that can show people that you actually have been through a formal learning process and have acquired knowledge that is relevant to what you're doing, then you're going to have a lot more credibility. So I've achieved that through my training through Susie Miller and the Alternative Divorce Directory. So I'm an accredited divorce PA, which is fantastic. And the thing about that is not only does it give me something that I can go to my clients and say, I'm an accredited divorce PA, but also it gives Susie Miller and all of the professionals on the Alternative Divorce Directory and it gives them the confidence that I'm somebody worth dealing with. So obviously it's fantastic to be great at typing and fantastic at filing but I've got those other skills too. So now I've proved that 
I not only have those hard skills, but I also have the soft skills that go with it. I'm good with people, I'm compassionate, I understand what they're going through, I understand the process of divorce, and I understand the importance of people having the correct help at the correct time presented in the right way. So what I have been able to do through my accreditation is to develop a proper comprehensive skill set which can be recognised and valued.